so music for my friends, other than having some dope friends featured on the project, what is the concept of this? You know, it really, literally is music for my friends. It's really music for the guys I grew up with my whole life or throughout various, you know, big portions of my life. And it's really just about us. And the idea of the album is really based around where you grow up, how you grow up, and who you grew up with around the ages of 13, 14 years old. Okay, gotcha. Because I feel like when you're a kid and you're, uh, when, when you're 13, 14 years old, those are your most formative years, right? And I know even specifically uh, the first single, Suicide Doors, there right. was a concept that even I know you were trying to get through with the artwork that kind of right, went, right, right. went over people's heads. Right, too. right, right. So yeah. explain the idea with the Suicide Doors. If you look at the hook, you know what I'm talking about, Suicide Doors, yeah. we saw the doors lifting up and then they never came down. Okay, so if you circle back to what the album is about and the theme and being 13 years old, when you're 13 years old, you don't know everything, but you think you do. And when you, you see these things in the neighborhood, you play the car game where you're sitting on the step, and you're like, yo, that's my car, yo, that's my car. And you exaggerate. Yo, yo, you saw it, it looked like a Batmobile. Yo, it looked like, <laughs> yo, it had, you know, 40-inch rims, and you know what I mean? Like, you, you exaggerate because you're 13, you're 13, 14, yeah. and, and you're so engulfed and so hyped and so enthused and, and passionate about, yo, I want that. Yeah. And then the guys in the neighborhood who got the money are buying things that they don't even know they bought or buying things that they may not understand because they were us at one point yeah. and they came up and got money however they got it and now they're the heroes. Yeah. So the idea was for the hook and the cover art to be wrong on purpose. Okay, to yeah. represent the ignorant innocence. Because yeah. you know it was what Lamborghini saying? doors on exactly. the album cover. Exactly. Yeah. It was on purpose. You yeah. know what I mean? And I'm like, okay, people listen to it, they'll get it. And then at the end, I put the Kanye sample where he goes, let up the suicide doors. Yeah. You can't let up suicide doors, yeah. you let them out. <laughs> exactly. But he said, let up. So I'm like, oh, okay, he made the wild mistake and nobody, you know, nobody paid attention to that. So yeah. if I use it on here, it'll tie it in together yeah. just to show how, even when you on, the mentality is still a certain way. It could still yeah. be wrong. Yeah. But, you know, it, it, it flew. It flew over people's heads. But what didn't fly over people's heads was the fact that the record is amazing. So at, that, at the end of the day, that's all I really cared about. You know what I mean? Let's talk about something I heard you doing you're writing a tv script yeah for a sitcom uh for a drama series for a dra drama series okay. yeah yeah so where where is that process and what is what is that uh, idea well it's an idea i had for a while now I'm working on it since about 06 07 really fleshing it out i hadn't started writing it i was fleshing out the concept the ideas the storylines where i wanted things to go like you know a and z and everything in between okay uh characters breaking down characters building them up putting together a process of how this thing would go and um, I did that for a while and then once I was done with that I decided to start literally writing the script writing the pilot writing the first episode writing the bible which is pretty much the synopsis of a series if you know TV talk you know the bible is the bio for the series you okay. know so writing the bible for it and yeah. you know um, putting together the, the, the pilot episode and you know I did that and now that's done and, and now I'm, I'm in the process of shooting you know, starting to shoot, getting all the ducks in, in a row to start shooting and um, and, and pitch, you know, okay. and that's where I'm at now. I can't really get into what the show is about. Yeah. Well, I mean, I can say it's based here, it's based in New York. Okay. Um, I can't really get into what it's about yet, but hopefully sooner rather than later, I'll be able to answer that because the show is picked up. Gotcha. You know what I mean? So. Does it have a name that you could share so far? It does have a name. <laughs> I, I can't really share that yet okay. either. It does have a name. Okay. It's named, it, it's, it's copyrighted and everything is laid out. Um, it, it, it's special though, man. It's very special. It's something I'm extremely proud of. Writing the first episode made me feel the way I felt when I was working on my first album. Mm. I felt the way I felt writing the Salvation. Okay. You know, when I that that feeling of the first joint, your debut, out the box, your whole life. That feeling came back when I was working on 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 this show. Yeah. You know, when I started working on this pilot episode, and when I finished it, it felt like that. It felt like I was going into mastering of the Salvation. I was like, wow, look at this.